How are you going now? I'm going well. What do you, what do you got here? Usual, have you? Volvo. Usual? Yeah. Not a Volvo. Kenilworth. There it is. Come there and talk is. to me about it, Ted. Hey? Eh? Come and talk to me about it. That's Battleship Grey. Had it from you? You're not gonna you're not gonna let me interview you, are you? Why? What do you want to know? I wanna know about you, your history and your truck. I'm still learning. Oh no, I'm only a green one. Three, two, one, we'll start again. Three, two, one. Ted Beamish, how the hell are you? I'm all right, what about you? Mate, I'm, I'm good, I'm good, but I'm more interested in talking about you. Tell me what you're doing here. Oh, I thought it'd be a nice day for a drive, so I'd come out there and have a look at all the gear. Your truck's, oh yes, your truck's over there. Let's go across and have a look at it, do a bit of video. Tell me about it. What can I say? Sit down. They're all the same. Yeah, 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 don't, <laughs> don't listen to those. See, now I'm going to have to beep that. See ya. <laughs> <laughs> As we were, Ted. So, Kenworth S2. Yes? No, if they are. Yes, they are. I meant that. I knew what I meant. You, you know what you're talking about. <laughs> I do when you blokes tell Had me. Had it from brand new, 1976, built up for big float work, 105 tonne gross. And that's your business, isn't it, float yeah. work? Yeah. Okay, how many Eight. trucks have you got in a business? No, oh, six. Okay. 8V92T. Now with an 18 speed double overdrive, putting fuel back in the tank, 44DT, fuel range diff. All the modern stuff. So you still work it? Yeah. All faithful. Yeah. That was your original truck that you kicked yeah. off with? Yeah. Do you start off in business by yourself or were you no. working for someone else oh, before I'm then? I born in it. I'm only doing what I know. Okay. So, we'll just walk around this way. Yeah. So what's your story, Ted? Oh, Where'd you come? Where are you from? On Turner. On Turner. Born and bred. So you've always stayed around the area? No. I was born probably at Northcote. Okay. Follow me around. The old man had a few trucks in the backyard there and grew too small the yard, so I went to Elfington, had more room. Mm -hmm. Then about 1960 went out to one Turner, plenty of room. Yeah, I so, started renting out part of the place to cover the land tax and start. pay the rates and land tax and all that. Mm -hmm. And also uh, so able to get enough money from the renters to build a new shed. So everything's under cover. Okay. So your father was a truckie? Yeah. And your future was set? You could say that. <laughs> all I know. No regrets? No. Oh. How long, Every day's different. How long you been in the, the game? Me? Yeah. Well, I left school at 16, so I suppose from then on. 20 years? Just the other day. Just, <laughs> <laughs> how old are you? You'd be retirement age close to, wouldn't you? What? Oh, you don't retire. Well, I know that. I'm talking about the government official number of 67. What age? 67. 67. Oh. I should have retired when, oh, five, seven years ago. There you go. Well, now you know, Ted. No, I'm going you, to you, going. you can retire and you can go on to a government pension of, gee, I don't know what it'd be, is $180 a week or something? Is it? I don't know, no, to be well, honest. Rita handles the paperwork for us. Uh, <laughs> She's a good old truck. It's been reliable for you, yeah? Oh, it has its moments. Oh, given its age, it's probably no surprise. far better than computer problems. Yeah. Yep. Most problems you've got, you know what the problem is and where and how to go about getting it mobile again. Yep. All right, beautiful. Ted Beamish, thank, thank you for, for uh, two minutes and 16 seconds of your time, sir. Oh, uh, thanks, Grady. <laughs> Cheers, All mate. All the best.